Even after 12 years of taking photos of the stars, that first time of the night where you see all that extra detail on the back of your camera, it still blows me away every time. My name is Jack Fusco. I'm an astrophotographer, and I've been taking photos of the stars for about 12 years. One of the lenses I've been really excited about using is the Sigma 15 millimeter F1.4 DGDN diagonal fisheye. I've been shooting with Sigma lenses for nearly a decade now, and I still remember the first time I took them out under the night sky. I was so blown away by the detail and the sharpness that from that point, Sigma lenses have been the only lenses in my bag. Being able to capture that massive view of the night sky and what it feels like to stand under that sea of stars is something I'm always chasing. And there's something about that 180 degree field of view that translates that so well. Images that I've had planned or have hoped to take for months or years, now with this 180 degree field of view and f1.4 aperture are suddenly possible. Taking photos all night means staying awake all night. So most of my shoots start with a stop at a local cafe and then a long drive to my location. We're gonna head down the trail a little bit and work on getting set up before we lose light and then break out one of the planning apps so we can see what's gonna be in the night sky before it gets too dark. Shooting at night means working with whatever light's available. And this lens, even in dark spaces, does an incredible job at rendering color. Another feature of this lens is the built-in tripod socket. It gives a really nice way to mount your camera using the foot and just have a really nice center of balance when you're all set up. One of the things I absolutely love about this lens is the inclusion of the manual focus lock switch. This is huge for astrophotography because it means you can dial in your focus and then not have to worry about it. Manual focus and then hit our infinity focus so the stars and our foreground are sharp. Hit that manual focus lock switch and it's good to go. As an astrophotographer, one of the first things I look for at a lens is how sharp the corners are. First shot of the night and just taking the time to check it out and review and making sure the stars look tack sharp. Just magnifying all the way in. And even though it's early, you can still see a ton of stars and just like an incredible amount of detail throughout the whole frame. Being able to shoot at f1.4 means letting as much light in as possible and still have like a relatively short exposure time and the ISO pretty low. It means this image is super clean and capturing tons of detail in both the sky and foreground. But you can also just see how beautiful the color is from those blues all the way up in the sky and even some of the, the greens in the dunes around us. It's a pretty windy night, so there's a little bit of sand and dust being blown around. But with the build quality of this lens being dust and splash resistant, it is not a concern at all. Over the course of 10 years, I've ended up in some pretty challenging conditions. And one of the things I've always been able to rely on is the build quality of Sigma lenses. Whether it's blistering heat in the desert or unbearable cold in the far north, I know these lenses are up for the challenge. It's rare that I find a lens that inspires me to shoot anything other than astrophotography. But with the 15, I've gone out and shot skateboarding, architectural images, and I've even gone and shot live music for the first time in 13 years. This also gave me the opportunity to test how fast the autofocus on this lens truly is. The speed and accuracy of how it locks onto a face is unbelievable. After shooting with a 15 millimeter fisheye in the field, I've realized that it makes my framing much more intentional and has challenged the way that I approach a scene. The 180 degree field of view and the f1.4 aperture and the manual focus lock switch is something that just doesn't exist in another lens. The ability to head out with this lens and capture something completely unique without compromising sharpness, contrast, image or build quality, is something that makes this lens really stand out. One of the things I've constantly appreciated is Sigma's innovation. It's something that's allowed my ideas to turn into images. Simply put, this lens unlocks creativity.